Well, a house party in Alice last weekend ended with more than 80 students being issued citations. Now, some of those who got into trouble are athletes. A concern is the football team traveled to Sinton tonight. Our Josh Maxwell was at that game at Pirate Stadium and spoke with parents. I think parents need to definitely uh, talk to the kids about uh, what's going on out there. Eric Enum is a proud Alice Coyote, showing up to support his team at Pirate Stadium, but he's also a parent who's keen on what's going on around his child's school. She definitely told me what's going on. Enum referring to the house party last weekend where 80 plus students were issued citations for minor in possession charges, 42 of those students voluntarily coming forward. Because of their choice, they got a lesser punishment that comes in the form of a mandatory drug and counseling session and a 14 day suspension. Enum says that while all students should be professional athletes should be more so there are people that uh we look kind of look up to so uh i think uh they should be hired uh held to a higher standard fellow alice resident jose sanchez says that while the students need to be held accountable true discipline begins at home the parents you know basically the parents that you know it's their duty to, you know, hey, where, where are your children? Sanchez says that while teams can be curious, the number of those involved should prompt concern. It's a hundred students, you know what I mean? That's quite a bit, you know what I mean? For you not to know where your child is at night. While 3 News was not able to confirm how many of the students were athletes, Alice ISD says that students had until Thursday to report themselves. Those who did not will receive a steeper punishment, including removal from the team and missing a critical district playoff game. Josh Maxwell, 3 News.